Hey friends, time for another podcast slash newsletter reading. So this time I would like to talk a little bit about patience in indie app development. Everyone is looking for magic formula or the best app idea to make it as indie app developer, but they do not exist. Indie app development is like a marathon, not a sprint. The longer you stick around, the less crowded it gets. There are plenty of wannabe indie hackers who disappear after a year of hustling, but most of the successful solopreneurs and indie hackers have been in the game for years. You can find examples of success stories where someone built the first product and become rich in a year or even less, but those are outliers. Patience is a key factor to success as indie developer. If you are not ready to spend a few years in a game, don't even bother, don't start especially if you are doing that part-time as most of us do. Sure, you can move faster if you are full-time solopreneur, but still, you need to learn a lot of things to succeed. Besides programming, you have to learn how to design and build MVP, how to launch the product in the App Store, how to grow the audience and monetize apps. Also, you have to figure out how to manage time just to create space for side projects, basically to... (laughs) Do not become crazy and still manage your day job, side hustle, family time, health, and still get time to sleep. It is not easy. And if it is your first year in the App Store, set your expectations for revenue low. Just do not care at all in the first year about revenue. Sure, you should monitor that as any other metrics, but do not care too much about that. So do not set yourself to failure, expecting to become rich quickly. There is no ceiling for revenue for indie devs. That's a good thing. You can earn 10 bucks, you can earn millions, but start can be painfully slow. Build apps, learn new skills, enjoy process, and eventually you will succeed. I myself still didn't make it by my own standards, but I'm happy with the progress. I was told by my friends that I make an indie dev career look easy. So now you know that it will take time, but I'm sharing my experience to help you to move faster. I could move much faster with the skills and knowledge I have today, but learning takes time. So keep shipping and stay in the game. And those who stay in the game for a long time, those will win eventually. (laughs) Bye.